Hello everyone. Recently I was asked, how do you just copy the chords from your song so that way you can then give a document to a collaborator to read off of and improvise over? So that's what I'm going to show in today's video with the copy to clipboard feature. In this video, I am demonstrating on the Windows version of Band in a Box, but the steps are also the same on the Mac version. So, here I have my song all loaded up. It's a cool Celtic jig. And I'll go up to the Edit menu, and then Copy Special. And there's a few different uh, really useful copying features within this secondary menu, but the one we're going to focus on is copy songs to text on clipboard or files. So this opens up a window where you can choose the different information that you want copied into your text document. Uh, let's say I just want all the information that we can have with the song uh, memos and metadata included, and I want the full song. You can choose just a range for your song here and set your bar numbers, but let's keep it to the whole song. So once you have all your settings ready, there are a couple different things you can do. So the first option is to save as a text file down here. So that opens up a window where you can choose where on your computer to save a text document uh, and then choose the name and save it. So on the left hand side here, you can choose anywhere on your computer to save, but I like saving things into my documents. So that's where I'm going to do it. And this name is a bit long, so I'm going to remove that and type in my own name. Um, how about example text song? Okay, and then when I'm ready, click the save button. So now if I open the file explorer and here I'm in this PC, so I want to go to documents. So I can select it either on the left hand side or up at the top here. And here is my example text song. And when you open it up, here is the info with the title, the file name, um, and all that info at the top. And then the chords are at the bottom. So that's one way to do it. So let's exit out of here and I'll show you the other way. So again, we want to go to edit. Copy special, copy songs to text on clipboard. So the other way is to go to OK, copy to clipboard. And you'll see this yellow message here saying that your song has been copied. And now you can open a text document like Microsoft Word or if you're on Mac Pages. Uh, so I'll just open my text document here. Or even if you're emailing someone, you can just paste directly into an email. So then I'll right click and select paste. And there's my song. So uh, here I've shown how to include all the information that you can about your song into the document. But if I undo this and go back, go to edit, cut, uh, copy special, copy songs to text. And let's uncheck include song metadata and uncheck include memo here. And then copy to clipboard again. So now when I copy into my document, it's only the chords. Uh, so sometimes that's all you need. So uh, that's a couple of useful checkboxes to take note of if you don't want to just erase the top section of your document. So those are the basics of the copy to clipboard feature. If you have any questions about this, please let us know in the comments section.